<laughs> what, what could be happening? Oh. Oh, there you are. Oh, I, are you I love kidding you guys. me? I love you. I miss you. How are you, sweetheart? Good to see you. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Oh, man, it is good to see you. Bob's back. Bob's back. Hi. Oh, oh, I didn't quite got up for you. I figured out if I should hug you or not. I don't know. Are you clean now? You're too short for me to shoot. Man, it's good to see you, buddy. Hey, we have a seat just for you. This one's yours, You know, that was, you know, they didn't get my tie straight. Did you notice that? I know. I don't know what's going on. How much weight have you lost? Yeah, you're looking good. I lost 35 pounds. Yeah. Wow. Yep. How'd you do that? I don't want to know. Uh, well, I'll tell you, what, you know, certain, certain Private diseases. Private trainer. Are, uh, a trainer. Yeah. <laughs> that's trainer. Right. Just say you had a trainer. Yeah. <laughs> well, Bob, it's hey. like you never hey. left. How are you? Congratulations. Welcome Thank back. You. Thank you very much. I should say congratulations to you, but I can't. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah. you don't skip a beat. No, I'll exactly. tell you something. I, 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 went, uh, I woke up. I had three back operations. Right? So I wake up out of the fog. You know, they yeah. give you the anesthesia. And I had this horrible dream. That Donald Trump got elected. Yes. <laughs> and then I woke up and I said, it's true. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I brought something for you on that note. <laughs> we, can, we can put this on your, uh, in the break, we'll put it on your suspenders. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, so we brought you back here just to rub that in. Yeah. Just so I, you thought, know. I thought you two were going away. I, that's what I was worried about. Oh, <laughs> that's right. Yeah, yeah. They, wanted a, the they wanted a Spanish Irish person to be press secretary. Huh? They, Rican, that's an idea. They get two of them covered. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, and they've done a great job so far, I think. You know, I mean, for example, I woke up this morning and I said to myself, for 50 years, they've been trying to get peace in the Middle East. Mm -hmm. And nobody could do it. Henry Kissinger, nobody. But Jared, son-in-law, he's now going to do it. Mm -hmm. Hope and change, babe. Well, I mean, how, you know, it couldn't he be worse than the building. last day, that's for sure. Eric, like, we, we shouldn't probably well, get right can into we just, Can, can no, we just like ease let's, back let's, into this relationship? Like, yeah. Wait a minute. I thought you'd be, you, I, I, you, what about, you must what be very happy to? Trump's in. Yeah. Now you have a worthy opponent. Are you kidding me, man? It's like plucking Are chickens. It's, it's going to be just great. No, I listen. I, did you I, miss us? Huh? Did you miss us? Oh, I missed you a lot. I mean, I tell you, I really did. And I miss the audience, too. Let me just say one thing. I don't get too serious, but but I got thousands of uh, of. Uh, Letters and other things from people out there, and I got to thank you. Most of you, right wingers, uh, who <laughs> said you were right wingers, uh, and but that you wish me well and you like me, and I appreciate it very much, and I missed you very, very much. Now that I'm humble enough, let's get uh, back well, to what, it. What, now, but let's see. The, how are the, the family? Kids are good. Kids are good. My daughter's in uh, Italy for uh, her junior semester, mm -hmm. uh, uh, semester abroad, which I've got to pay the bill for on February 1st. So. I know you're back. <laughs> you have until February 5th. You know how I know? Uh, my son goes to the same school. Oh, that's yeah. right. <laughs> oh, you got four more days. Oh, my about. goodness. So how interesting. Right. I, I needed a job, so I figured I'd come back and get paid and then pay her off. Uh, and then my son actually, believe it or not, started this little thing. You know this is dance music stuff. Mm -hmm. You know, they do these clubs, all that stuff. I can't stand it. IDM. Computer crap yeah. that they, you know, they get through their like play. Like techno and, music. Yeah. Oh, day. yeah. I mean, you can't hear yourself talk, no. you know. Uh, <laughs> Eric couldn't even drink during that. No. Uh, but uh, I'll tell you, he started on this thing four years ago as a kind of a junior guy at a uh, a management company for those guys, mm -hmm. and uh, he's now got a big job. That's good. Wow. Well, yeah. congratulations. I'm very happy for both your children. That's very now we, sweet. We, we have a little something that we put together for you that we thought you might want to see and the audience might want to see. Um, we shouldn't mention that Juan Williams, who uh, has, been, is, is a part of, has been a part of the five from the beginning, will continue to be. Yes, and um, so we're going to welcome Bob back. Uh, to this seat today and for many future days in the future, several yeah. times a week, I understand. It's, uh, yeah. And so you'll continue to see one here, and then, of course, on shows where his intellect will be appreciated, like on special <laughs> reports. Yes, yes, on a real show. A real show. A real show. A real show. Is that, is that to suggest that I don't have any intellect? No, no, no. no, no. It's, 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 more, a, more it's a collective. Yeah. We're saying that you're just thing. perfect. No, Juan <laughs> called me one day and he said, How do you do it? How do you right. do it? And I said, yeah. It's pretty simple. First of all, if you can't win in the arg argument, you change the topic. Uh, and you say, why didn't Eric invite us to his beach house? You remember that? Yep, that was a good uh, one. That was a good one. And We're still waiting. 
But, <laughs> yeah. Aren't you? Me too. Right? It's amazing. Yeah. Uh, and then the other thing is you got to uh, laugh a lot. you got to have a lot of sense of humor. And Juan's uh, biggest setback is he's smart. <laughs> what are you trying to say? Well, it's just, just That's uh, not a, a perfect I, I graduated at the table. with 2.0001, oh, 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 and that was on a football scholarship, but that's because I had an affair with a French teacher. Were you, uh, oh, were you, were you uh, upset that you weren't here for this whole thing? And the oh, Greg, I, I mean, it, it just broke my heart. Yeah. I, I mean, I just, the whole thought of it, uh, it, it the, this... Were you uh, screaming country, at the television when you watched us? No, the television wasn't working anymore <laughs> because <laughs> as soon as Wisconsin went, that was the end of it. No, uh, actually, I was uh, uh, looking at something in uh, a county in North Carolina. Seriously. And it's a little county. I know North Carolina real well. I've done a lot of work down there. And it's called Cherokee County. And normally it's 55-45 Republican. And I put the thing on, and it's 85-15 for Trump. Mm -hmm. and I said, wait a minute. So I started to check all these rural counties, and I realized that she, he was winning so big in those counties. Didn't yeah. matter what she did in the cities. Mm -hmm. So uh, it was, uh, but it was still. A would you like to before we talk politics? Would you like to watch a little something, a little trip down memory, memory lane, lane, Bobby? Uh, I guess. Okay, here's a look back it's at Bob swearing, back home on the five. We look <laughs> forward to a lot more of this. We're still on delay. He had more bankruptcies than anybody else. He may be in bankruptcy now, as far as I know. I happen to think that Donald Trump actually is a nice guy. But why we give this attention to this guy? Could you do, do a serious analysis of Donald Trump running for president? I keep a straight face. Bob has gotten much nicer over the last month or two. That's, that's because your lawyer threatened to sue me, Don. Uh, no, yeah. I'm only kidding. You're a developer. You do a lot of things. You're, you're TV talent. What you ain't, Don, is a politician. Mr. Trump, you are full of another word for dog poop. As much as I just love the thought of having another Trump discussion, him pledging a 50% tax cut is like a kid in eighth grade running for class president saying he's going to cut all homework out. I want to uh, give uh, a talk about my old buddy Donald Trump, who's, uh, you know, a political extraordinaire. The Donald's decided he is seriously now considering running in 2016. I have a candidate already, and that's Teddy Cruz. I have an idea. Here's the perfect ticket for the Republicans. Cruz, Trump. What do you think of Ted Cruz for Supreme Court? I think it's a great idea. <laughs> right. No, remember, this is the only thing that the Democrats have any control over. We had 60 votes to, to get a Supreme Court nominee, and Teddy Cruz would not get a single Democratic vote. I'm not sure he'd get all the Republican votes. But, you know, the one thing you guys missed about mm -hmm. me not being here, Yeah. you want to know what it was? What was it? It was November 1st. Mm -hmm. That's when I predicted that Donald Trump was going to be elected president. Wait. Whoa. Oh, that's so not true. Stop it. Uh, we, wait, you know, we, we, we didn't put in the montage of you saying hey, it, I, you said that Hillary was going to beat him from prison. Right. From prison, you, less than 1% chance. But you changed your mind on she, November 1st. She didn't get there yet? <laughs> no. Oh, okay. Uh, it was, uh, Wait, there's a thing called the internet where we can see what you say uh, elsewhere too. <laughs> yeah, I understand. Bob, but you what, know do you make, <laughs> what do you make of the um, Democrats who have said that they are not going to go to the inauguration? Well, you know, I, there's been uh, there were a few Republicans who didn't go to, to uh, Obama's inauguration, but not like this. This is organized. You got to understand um, on a very serious note how angry the. Uh, the people who voted against Trump are. I mean, there's an anti-Trump wave coming. And I've been at a couple of meetings. And, and matter of fact, I went to a meeting of a group of progressive people. And they're not all a bunch of progressives in Black Lives Matter. These are 66 million people out there. A percentage of them are going to be uh, are angry. And they're getting angrier. That's the worst part about it. But uh, I went to a meeting. And somebody said, well, what do you think we should do? I said, well, anything legal to you know, get in his way is fine with me. And I said, but don't interrupt his inaugural. I mean, that's, you know, they give the guy a day. I got booed out of the room. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I mean, it, it's, it, you can't, you, can't it, you just have to understand, when you come from my side of the aisle, how much people can't stand this guy. And I don't and include he myself. He hasn't done in anything that. yet. And, and Bob, right. oh, yeah, he's, 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 you know he's going to give you single 50, payer. 60,000 jobs have ever, already been pledged to mm -hmm. stay in America since he's, you know, since he's talking about his uh, corporate restructuring uh, of, of, of taxes. 53 and million already decided, 53,000 decided there already before he got elected. But uh, leaving that aside, I think, look, this guy can tweet and he makes news everywhere. I want to see the tweets turned into policy. But this morning I found out
Mm -hmm. that a guy that lives down the street from me, he's a paraplegic, he has pre-existing conditions, obviously, he's got diabetes, he's very sick, and Trump says, don't worry, I'm going to cover you. Now, if he covers this guy, mm -hmm. then I won't say I'll be a Trump guy, but I, you know. So, so you're Hope leaving the door eternal. open. Leaving the door open. That goes what? For, for being a Trump guy. No. Oh, God, no. Please. Wait, Bob, you just... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bob's back. What can I tell you? <laughs> Did I say something twice in one... No, yeah. well, we just, you know, I mean, you know, you got to leave the okay, door let open. Let me ask you. Let me, let you got to give him a chance. Something. Wait a second. What have Who you got to lose? Who like was he surprised? Said. Gregory? Yeah, I was pretty shocked. Yeah, I think, uh, I think what I said on Twitter probably uh, summarized how I felt. Began with a, the first word began with an H, and the second one began with an S, <laughs> and, and, it, and rhymes with pit. So I think that's how I felt. I, got that. I, um, I, w I was curious, you, how was the green room food at CNN compared to ours? Well, it's pretty good, uh, isn't it? You know, I was I was told not to mention CNN. Oh, so thanks, Greg. Uh, yeah, now we've got a 30 second cue. in a box like that. Let me I just, did not know. Let me just say Nobody I appreciate my opportunity. But when somebody says to me in an argument, hey, you know, you and I argue. You know, we sit there and we hit each other. One day leading to a comment that I wish I didn't. <laughs> we'll uh, get to that later. We'll you, get to that later. But uh, there, somebody said to me, I hate to disagree with my esteemed colleague. Oh. And I said, you what? <laughs> you actually fell asleep during a Don Lemon segment. I, I remember I that. Did. Yeah, yeah you did. Was. You were like, you, they came to you and you were just like this. And I go, like the rest of America. Well, but this is all, he did that here one he, time too. And I was like, oh, wait a second. Because why, we were wondering why we, have to, we tossed a shepherd. Hey, wait, we can do it here. And I'm like, there you go. You, you know what you did miss though? Napping. Well, over the summer, Napping we now. spent... Two, three weeks on a, a bus, bus together. Yes. We did a bus. Oh, we did a road trip from here. Uh, I really, really only one to week Philadelphia on a bus. Philadelphia and back, you would have had a great time. Uh, yeah. Uh, what uh, did oh, you stop? Oh, he wouldn't have wanted to do the, what, kiss a pig contest. But, yeah, I already, who did, did, that. Who did, I already did that one time on New Year's Eve. We'll catch you up. <laughs> uh, we're All right, catch stay you. right you know, there. Justin, wait, wait a second. Wait, 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 wait a second. I was just going to say, give you a compliment. You two did a great job New Year's Thank Eve. You, I'm taking it back. All right, but stay right there. Much more catching up with Bob to do. And later, make sure to join us on a fun trip down Beckel Lane. Don't go away. Beckel